Fawfalizer here, and welcome to the Defawfalizer Christmas Special. Here, I'm going to be playing a Christmas-themed Inca game. If the Grinch Saw game is out by the time you're seeing this, please note it was not out at the time of recording this. So instead, I'm playing Obama and Pigsaw's Gift. Even though it's called Pigsaw's Gift. Oh, no, it actually is called Obama and Pigsaw's Gift. What am I? I know. The evil Pigsaw is waiting for his Christmas present, but everything indicates Santa Claus won't be delivering any this year since someone stole them from him. The evil puppet will send Obama to the North Pole to solve the case and get the presents back. You know, for an evil puppet, that's not all that evil of a thing for Pigsaw to be doing. I mean... Yeah, I mean, he's saving Christmas. That, that's kind of a good thing. Um, and I, I like this Christmas music they made. I think it's pretty good. I mean, I know it's like Jingle Bells, but their own instrumentation and stuff. So anyway, let's start the game. It's Obama and Pigsaw's gift. Let's start. Just a few hours left until Christmas Eve. I better go home to my family. God, I'm terrible at impersonations. Hi, Obama. Are you are you gonna make me play a, a an evil with evil game on Christmas? Are you crazy? Yes. How did you know? I swear, Pig Saw's the only voice I could do on these. Don't tell me you've kidnapped my family again. Why so quiet? It's just that you told me not to tell you. <laughs> well, enough of this nonsense. I've certainly kidnapped your family once again too. Well, you already know. Make me play your evil and twisted game. Bingo. Well, let me explain what is it about this time. Confidential sources tell me that Santa Claus is having serious troubles. And because of that, he won't be delivering presents this Christmas. How come you're so worried about the presents that Santa Claus gives on Christmas? You see, unlike on other years, this one I wrote a letter to Santa and asked for something I've always wanted. But Santa Claus only gives presents to those who behave good. Exactly. I have a hard time making up all the good deeds I put on my letter. Helping an old lady cross the street, getting a cat down from a tree, blah blah blah. Apparently Santa bought it. In conclusion, if Santa can't deliver presents, I won't get mine. Your mission is to help me with whatever trouble he might be having, so he can deliver the presents. You should hurry if you want to see your family again. Let the game begin. I have to go to the North Pole as soon as possible. Christmas Eve is just around the corner. Okay, I have no clue what that's about. Line, line. There is Santa Claus. He looks sad. Let's talk to him. Good afternoon, Santa. Good afternoon, though. I should say bad afternoon. What's happened? You mean what hasn't happened? Today certainly is not my lucky day. First, the Grinch stole all the presents from me. And why don't you tell the elves to make more? The elves are on vacations in the Caribbean and won't answer my calls. Shouldn't you put them on vacation right after Christmas? Hey, Filiberto, have you wondered what happened if Santa had a last minute setback while we were in Aruba taking a sun bath with our cell phones turned off? No, Ludikivo, I haven't thought of it, and I suggest you do the same. You're right, I'll just relax for now. Why don't you try to get the presents back? It's too dangerous. The Grinch is guarded by an evil snowman. And what happened in the reindeers? They're on strike. On strike? They are, they're asking... Uh, that's all they ask, money. And to tell you the truth, giving away presents for free business is not profitable. I can hardly pay the rent. Wow, you sure are in trouble, Santa. Let me see what I can do for you. I appreciate it, but I don't think you can help me. You know what's kind of funny if you think about it? 
If you played Lady Gaga Saw game, apparently the Grinch has worked for Pigsaw because he was in that game. So shouldn't Pigsaw just be able to call up the Grinch and say, um, hey, can you give back the presents? Because I mean, think about it. Who else would it be? Who else? How? Who else would Santa know at the North Pole? Oh, and know it's uh, even the funnier part. I guess there's no continuity, because, I mean, excuse me, Mr. Reindeer, can I talk to you? Because Pigsaw's going to be kidnapping the Grinch soon enough. I bet at you're coming on behalf of Santa to talk to us. But know that we're not flying again until he meets our demands. We've flown free for several years, and now that's over. I understand, but Santa... Let's cut to the chase. Are we getting paid? You s you'll see, the giveaway... Pr as in business for free is not profitable. Same old story. Don't interrupt me unless you bring me some green news. This is gonna be tougher than I thought. You know, that just reminds me of like that one epigraph battle of history. So as you can see, we have the North Pole, Macaulay's house, Rainbow Forest and uh, Halloween Town. So we got the three kids from um, Nightmare Before Christmas. Um, uh, Barrel, Lock, and Shock. I clear. I clearly knew those without r rubbing my mouse over them. I have seen the Night Before Christmas, Nightmare Before Christmas once. I, I thought it was a pretty good movie. Like I like the music. I like Jack Skellington. It's overall a pretty good movie. Um, I'd talk to them, but I don't, they don't really have much to offer us, but, eh, why not? Good afternoon, kids. Good afternoon. Are not? What? What are you doing inside a bathtub? We are in this bathtub to see. Who's the f first one to ask, what are we doing inside a bathtub? I was just curious. Okay, well, let's not bother them anymore. Hey, Jack. Hi. Hi. I think I've seen you act in a movie. Got lag. I think I've seen you act in a movie. That's right. They filmed a movie a few years ago here in Halloween Town. The title they came up with was weird, by the way. What was it? The Nightmare Before Christmas. Hmm, that sounds creepy. It's a good movie, though, Obama. You really should check it out. Do my eyes deceive me, or is that a floating stone? That's right, this is the famous floating stone of Halloween Town. That's interesting. Can I have it? As long as I give it, I'd give it to you as long as I don't need zero with me, something, something I understand. Why are you so sad? I can't find my little dog Zero. I looked for him everywhere in Halloween Town and I can't seem to find him. That's bad news. Just in case, what does your dog look like? He's got a red nose, uses a blanket, and floats. Ooh, okay, I'll let you know. Okay, gotta get that candy cane. Um, candle. And you have to grab this skeleton. I don't know if there's a puzzle indicating that, but who would say that old pool could work? That is actually the same every time. I know it's rare for like a puzzle in Inky Games to be the same every time, but it is here. Okay, now we have to get out of here. We're going to Macaulay's house. For the last time, you little brat, where are the presents? I swear, I don't know. Santa Claus doesn't come here yet. Something must have happened to him. You're lying. I've seen you on the big screen. I know you're clever. But let me tell you, you'll need more than that. I'll get those presents one way or another. You know, that's actually the kind of funny thing about, um... About this, it's like a crossover of a bunch of different specials. I mean, you got The Grinch, Nightmare Before Christmas, Gremlins, and Home Alone. And So you're going to want to put this flask with somniferous on the candy. Not the candy cane, just the candy. There's, there's clearly a difference there. And, oh look, 
The one gremlin gets it and sleeping on the job. How irresponsible. <coughs> sleeping on duty. How irresponsible. I think we got rid of one. Well, it's not that irresponsible if you've been poisoned, if you know what I mean. Okay, took the ladder with me. God, this game's lagging like crazy. Like, it was lagging the first time I played it, too. So I was going on the fan, and boom, went right into the lion's mouth. Something weird is going on here. From here, I'll catch any intruder who dares to enter, and I forgot to get something. Back to Halloween Town. Get this broom. Can't you go around the other way, Obama? Oh no, because I guess the world ends afterwards. So. You know, I've been thinking more and more about, um. I'll teach you a lesson! The gremlins are aggressive creatures. Try not to fight face to face. But um, I've been thinking more and more about Coraline in the secret door. And you know. I might actually do that. That'll keep him out of combat for a while. I'd consider doing it maybe next year. I'd have to have like a lot of preparation, but I could do it. See, see how much lag this is having? Macaulay Culkin. Calm down now, you're free. The gremlins are out of combat. Thanks, Obama, I swear. That, that face just does not look right. You're welcome. I'm a big fan of yours. I've seen all your movies. Really? I thought people had forgotten me already. No one will ever forget Home Alone. They will forget the sequels, but not the original. Don't say that, Daniel. I'm sure a lot of people remember you. Daniel? What? Aren't you Dennis the Menace? <laughs> er, no. There's been a confusion. I'm not Daniel. I'm Macaulay Culkin. Oops, well, changing the subject. I'm trying to solve a little problem. I could use anything you can give me. Sure, maybe, maybe my water gun, my blow gun, and my explosive will come in handy. Thanks, Dan. I mean, Macaulay. So, yeah, we got all that. And in exchange, I'll give you some Obamacare. No, it, it's fine. I, I really don't need it or want your Obamacare. Okay, so we've got... Everything we need to get zero back, so first I'm gonna take this empty bottle and... What the heck? I can't... Why can't I do that? I can do that later, but I can't do it right now, I guess. Okay, so I'll do it later. Oh, I remember now. Uh, I'll be... I'll be going back there in a second, so... Put this dynamite here, and they're in for a little surprise! That was an explosive surprise, and I forgot this on my last time, too. There's a trampoline hidden in this corner that you need. Okay, so anyway, back to Halloween Town. There's a couple things you need. First, trampoline. Oh, I have to actually click on it. Okay, so now, um... Now let's open up the door and see what's inside. What do we have? It's um something. Ooh, it's zero or a dog. That's a rather ghostly dog. Well, then again, it, it is zero. This is Nightmare Before Christmas. I think I should know that by now. Hey Jack, you want zero? Oh, you want him? Well, I'm gonna give him to you. Here, here you go, your dog. I love it when they say that. Zero, my friend. Where have you been? Some kids had him. Thanks a lot, friend. No problem. But in return, I get this stone. <coughs> so Jack's floating stone, and I forgot to do something. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. Okay, so I need to fill the water gun with, um the green acid liquid we don't need it just yet but it'll be helpful for what we're doing later so now we're gonna put the shrinking pill inside the blowpipe 
and then shoot it right into the goblin's mouth. Oh, and he's dead. Well, he's shrunk. Looks like the little bird is hungry. You know, I'm just remembering like um that whole thing uh in um my running gag in Obama and Michael, how I was pointing out how violent Obama was in that game, despite the fact that in Obama versus Aliens, he says he hates violence. Oh wait, remember my teletransporter? <laughs> so I got gold point gold coins and a round stone. Now I believe we have everything we need. Hey, I'm setting this whole bet down. I believe this is enough to cover your feet. Wow, now we're talking. I love how he was instantly smiling despite the fact he wouldn't be able to see it because of the newspaper. Guys, strike is over. Let's go now. But before we give him back to Santa, I think it would be rude to also to get let's see how you like this no and you can take his hat but um it's like death scythe in the homer saw game there's no real reason to take it okay now this this is a bit complicated but not unmanageable God, the lag, the lag, the lag is killing me. We're all dying of lag poisoning. The lag, the lag, the lag is super deadly. I cannot stand it anymore. The lag is horrible. Yeah. I don't know, that was a song I made up about lag. <coughs> well, we killed the Grinch. You're a mean one. Evil Grinch got what he deserved. Jump off, Obama! Oh yeah, under normal circumstances, that cat would wake up the Grinch, but he didn't there. He's not so brave without his master, and the member will pull and open up a hole in um, the North Pole somehow. I don't know how that would work. Anyway, now we have to go all the way back to Santa. Oh my god, just the lag, the lag, the lag is killing me. The lag is killing me all the time. Lag, la lag, la lag, la lag. At least it doesn't make the game unplayable. Like, I think in um, the Obama Inc. Games Rescue. God, I remember that. My presents, you've got them back. That's right, Santa. The Grinch gladly re agreed to return the presents. And by the way, the evil snowman is history now. Now we just need the reindeers. The reindeers, you talked some sense to them. That's right, Santa. They were anxious to go back to work. God, you're good at lying, Obama. Well, you are a politician. Oh, oh, good job, Obama. Finally, the kids will get their presents. Good luck. Uh, good luck, Santa. By the way, don't you want to ride home? Your house is the first on my list. Fly in Santa's sled? That's the best present ever. What are you waiting for? Hop on already. I mean, Air Force One's probably still here, but, you know, we'll fasten your sit belts. I mean, Air Force One's probably still here, and I'll have to come back to the North Pole to get it, but hey, it's worth it to ride with Santa. Hi, family. I see Pigsaw let you go already. I'm glad. Pigsaw? We haven't seen him since Pigsaw Revenge. What are you talking about, honey? He didn't kidnap you? I've been tricked to... Do I think I've been tricked to do something. Something I would have gladly done anyway. Well... The important thing is that we're all together, and wait to see who will come with me. So I guess Obama's gift was that Pig Saw didn't kidnap his family. Hi, Sasha. Hi, Malaya. I see you've been good girls this year. You know, Santa, you're supposed to do it when they're asleep. Haven't you played Santa Row 4? I bought these little friends for you. This is it for you, Sasha. Thanks, Santa Claus. 
And this is for you, Malaya. I know your dad could buy all these things, but I felt the need to give them to you. Thanks, Santa Claus. Now, if you excuse me, I got to deliver presents to the kids around the world. Merry Christmas! Ho, ho, ho! And goodbye, Santa. Thanks for helping me save Christmas. If you like this adventure, go to www.inkygames.com and keep having a good time. Merry Christmas, everyone. And what did Pigsaw ask for, for, for Christmas? Yep. They did that. Ah, uh, that. I, I love that ending. I had forgotten about the whole motor motorcycle thing until, um, you know, the time I played it earlier today. But this was fun. This was fun. Um, and while we're here, I think before I go, I'll reveal to you a super, the secretest secret of secret tome, as Patrick Star would call it. My next countdown, or the video that's going to come out next week. Now, I bet you're wondering what it's going to be, unless you've, you know, been reading the comments on my videos, but, um, it is going to be top 14 defaultalizer countdowns of 2015. Yeah. Get ready.